Hey, hello everyone. Welcome to Mithun Technologies. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a shell script to install the open JDK Java software in the Linux server. So already I created one video for sale for installing that uh, open JDK, the Java software in the Linux server. I have created one shell script. So that is a part one. So in the part two, <clears throat> what I'm going to show you so if you see in this part one, this is a script I have written. So here what I'm doing, I'm hard coding that uh, Java version, right? So instead of hard coding that Java version, you have to pass dynamically. So it is going to ask, when you are going to run the script, it is going to ask that, uh, <clears throat> please type the Java package, whatever the package, whatever the version you want. So for that one, I'm going to change that uh, small modification. So if you want to go to that, uh, the version one, whatever the Java <clears throat> installation one, if you go to our YouTube channel, if you see here, shell script to install open JDK 11 in the Linux server. So this is a part one. So now I, we are doing that uh, part two. So what I'm going to do, just I will, Copy paste this script, this one. Okay. So here, till here, I'm going to write another script. So it's already <clears throat> there. See, just we are checking that uh, whether Java is installed or not. If it is installed, which version of Java? And here, checking that uh, whether previous command is executed successfully or not. By using this one, we can identify whether Java is installed or not. So if this condition is executed, this uh, condition is satisfied, means we can say that uh, Java has already installed. Right. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, it will come to the else block. So Java has not installed. So we are going to install Java. <coughs> so for that one, echo. Please type the Java package which version you want to install. Okay, so here we are going to use the read command. Read, then specify that uh, Java package with the uh, version. So this is a one variable. Okay, this is a command. So now we are going to use that uh, sudo yvm install and uh, whatever that package the user is going to type right so that one we need to so for that one you can use this uh, variable dollar and variable and i find why automatically it is going to take as a confirmation so if it is installed successfully then you can display message so java has installed successfully and uh, again if you want to display a version which version of java has installed Specify it. Okay, so Java version is then execute this command Java space hyphen version. Okay, so we need to close the if condition. So for that one, we are going to use the F5. Okay, so now let me <clears throat> take this script. So select copy so already i have connected to the linux server see it is showing that uh, linux then i am going to create one script va java install specific version dot sh hit the enter then type i it will come insert mode, then paste this content. Right. So this is a <clears throat> shebang line. The, the, these are the copyrights section. So this is the actual Java the <clears throat> shell script. Right. For installing the Java. So now save it. And you can give the execute permissions for this one for the user chmod u plus x 
and uh, copy this uh, file name and paste it. Hit the enter. So now you can run it. <clears throat> dot slash Java installation specific version dot sh. Hit the tab. Automatically it is going to populate. Hit the enter. See now, it is showing that uh, <coughs> Java has not installed. Please type the Java package, which version you want to install. Okay. So first it is executed Java command. It's not found. Means Java has not installed. So now it is uh, going to install. So for that one, we need to specify the package name. So which package you want to specify? See, already <coughs> we searched with one name. Right, open JDK 11. So earlier uh, example. So now I am going to install that Java 8. Open JDK 8. Search with this one. And uh, see here, access.redhat.com. Click on this one. It will take you to that uh, official page where you can get that uh, the package name. Okay. So you can take it here. <clears throat> this one. Okay, copy and uh, you can paste it here. So, in this case, it is going to install that uh, Java 11. Okay, <coughs> Java 11, it is going to install. Then hit the enter. Okay, so it is going to hit the it is going to install this particular version. Okay, hit the enter button. So it is asking password. So even we have solution for this one also in sudo s file, you can update it. So now I am going to type that uh, password for the Basker user because uh, Basker is a normal user. So for Basker user, uh, sudo access is there. By using the Basker user, we are installing. Okay. Just uh, type the Basker user password and hit the enter button. So now it is going to install that uh, Java. <clears throat> so whatever the version we have specified. So in this uh, example, we have installed, we have uh, selected that uh, Java 1.8, right? So now it is going to install this uh, Java 1.8 version. So in earlier example, the <coughs> Java 1 example, the installation 1 part 1, we have installed that uh, Java 11, right? So now we are installing that uh, Java 1.8. So before starting this uh, session, I have uninstalled whatever that uh, example was there earlier. Right, whatever the Java which we have installed, I have uninstalled that one. So now I'm installing this uh, <clears throat> 1.8. So it is uh, taking some time. Okay, we'll see. See, it's installing. So it is taking some time, but uh, it's installing. Right, see, observe that. It is installing that uh, Java 1.8. Right. <clears throat> okay. So sometimes due to network uh, 
it may take some time network issues okay just we have to wait Okay, so it's uh, installing. Okay, wait some time. <clears throat> so it's almost done. Right. Just it is validating now. Okay. Yeah, it's verifying that all the packages, so whatever it is uh, installed. <clears throat> then we are going to check that uh, version. So in the script itself, uh, we have written. Okay, see, it's completed. Now it is going to execute that uh, <clears throat> again. One echo message. See, Java has installed successfully. And uh, see that? Which version we have installed? 1.8. So like that, you can... Whatever the version you want to install, just you can go to that Google. Okay, just uh, check that one. Suppose you want to install that ja <coughs> OpenJDK 11. Search with this one, OpenJDK 11. See here, uh, try to get that uh, package name from this website, access.redhat.com, <coughs> the official uh, website. So just uh, scroll down. You see here, uh, uh, this is a package name for the Ah, this is the package name for uh, open JDK 11, 11 version. So earlier we used that 8, right? So like that, whatever the version you want, you can verify it. So like this, we can pass that Java with the uh, package name with version. So automatically it is going to install whatever the package name we have installed. Okay. So guys, if you have any questions, Reach out to Bethune Technologies. Before that, uh, please subscribe everyone to this our uh, YouTube channel, which is having very good videos. And also see, before going to refer this video, first go through this uh, video. This is a video one, which I have created. See, <coughs> shell script to install this one. Okay. This is uh, version one. Okay. And uh, please <coughs> click on this bell icon so that uh, as soon as if I upload any new videos, you are going to get that notification. And also, if you see here, we have one blog is there for uh, this DevOps related information we have created. You can follow up this uh, also. And uh, we have one Mithun Technologies page is there. <coughs> follow this one, Mithun Technologies uh, Facebook page for uh, any free webinars and material we are going to share. So if you have any questions still, you can reach out to Mithun Technologies, any of these numbers, or you can send an email to this Gmail ID. Thank you.